effectiveness is going to be more appealing for the uppers of sets and overall your confidence is going to go up the roof as well. What's up people, it's your boy Andrew FAQ here with you for another YouTube video. I'm excited for this one, let's go! So today, I'm going to be discussing how to be more handsome on a budget. Listen guys, nowadays we're living in, a, in an era where being attractive it is key. I'm telling you now, people now are trying to improve their looks, their physiques, how they dress, because the market now is evolving rapidly. To be attractive, to stand up from the crowd, you've got to do certain things to be your best self. And today I'm going to be breaking that down even further to do all of that on a budget. Number one, guys, you need to be buying fitted clothing to maximize your look. Ain't all about wearing baggy fits. Listen, I'm telling you now, I see you guys wearing baggy fits. You look like a homeless child, man. That is not happening. Baggy fits, especially if you're out in public and you're wearing baggy clothing, you're not going to look like you know how to dress. I'm telling you now, wearing the right fitted clothing, and it doesn't have to be expensive as well. You can get the stretch fits clothing that Zara has. Because me, I shop in Zara a lot. Zara, you can get the stretch fits clothing that can tape around your muscles and easily bring out your physique even more and enhance your look. And you can even spend about 60, 60 pound or less on the top instead of spending 300 pound on a tailored suit. Those are the ways that are going to help you improve your overall look, your overall, the way you, the way you dress. I'm telling you now, wearing a fit, slim fitted stretch clothing is going to make you more attractive to females because now your physique that you'll be working on in the gym is going to start to show more. You're going to look more masculine instead of looking like some homeless guy wearing some baggy clothes. Because baggy clothes only works in certain areas, but if you're going out and you're going out in the public, make sure you wear the right fitted clothing. All right, <laughs> quick one guys. I had to switch location because the previous one had traffic coming through it. So we're now in a better location. Hopefully, no disturbance. So what I'm saying is having the right fitted clothing to improve your physique, your overall look. Right, so we're back at the original spot because that's what had more traffic coming in. So we're back here. Listen, it ain't easy me trying to record outside. Beautiful weather, a lot of wheels out, but we move. All right, so number two is looking after your teeth. Guys, having good teeth, it is key to improving your handsomeness. I'm telling you now, yeah. If your teeth is not in shape or it's yellow, straight away, if you're talking to a female, that's gonna put, that's gonna put them off if you've got bad teeth, crooked teeth. Me, I'm trying to improve my teeth. I'm using like teeth whitening strips. Before, I was even considering getting veneers, but that's expensive, so I thought, not. That must be an easier way just to whiten my teeth to improve my attractiveness instead of me breaking the bank. So I've come up, I've started using this product here. It's called Wisdom. This product here helps. Using that three times, um, what, twice a day. For a whole week, you'll see a big improvement in your teeth. The yellow will start to become more white. So definitely pick up a teeth whitening strips that's gonna help improve your, your teeth overall instead of going to get the nails done or like doing some, some next thing that's gonna cost you thousands and thousands of pounds. You don't need to do that. But definitely getting the white teeth whitening is going to help improve your handsomeness. It's going to help improve your look. So when you're talking to girls, your confidence is going to become more apparent. You're going to get more confident because you know you've got good teeth. Because you know a lot of times when you're talking, people are looking at your teeth, checking if you've got good hygiene. Hygiene is important when it comes to improving your handsomeness. So guys, make sure that you're picking up the right teeth products to improve your teeth, the colours. Make sure it gets more whiter. And overall, you're going to become more handsome for cheap. These things you can pick up for about 16 pound, 10 pound, depending on the brand. But it's, it's way more cheaper than spending a thousand of pounds to get the nails done. So I recommend getting the right tea product that will improve your teeth overall. Number three is finding the right hairstyle for you. Guys, <laughs> it's funny because when I started getting my hair cut, I used to have braids before when I was younger. That was nice for the trend, let's say 10 years ago. But as you get older, you're gonna find the right hairstyle that's gonna suit your look. Make sure, bring out your jawline. So me, I've gone for sort of like the sponge top, faded sides, skin faded sides, and a goatee. Before I was trying to grow my beard, but it wasn't happening, mate. I even so much products, but my beard wasn't growing. So I decided to go for the goatee look, and, that's, and that helps improve my jawline. It's also brought up my, my, my features more as well. 
So I would say finding the right hairstyle is going to improve your handsomeness, improve your attractiveness as well. Because if you've got a different hairstyle that's not to suit your face, your attractiveness is not going to go as better as you think. So finding the right hairstyle, improving your overall look, I'm telling you now, that's going to improve yourself. Skin fade is in is in right now. Like getting a nice skin fade, make sure to get make sure to get a good fade as well. Because sometimes the barber you go to, the skin fade is not as good. So make sure you get the right barbers that's gonna give you a nice skin fade. And overall, make sure your hairline doesn't go back as well. Because a lot of barbers are pushing people's head wig back, man. Be careful with that as well. Don't get go to the wrong barber that's gonna keep pushing your wig back and before you know you've got to like draw back and stuff, and that's gonna mess up your whole overall look, mate. So make sure you pick the right barbers that's gonna give you a nice skin fade, a nice haircut nice shape up and also shape your beard up to make sure your attractiveness is going to be more appealing for the opposite sex and overall your confidence is going to go up the roof as well finding the right hairstyle will save you money in the long run obviously you might look the same all the time but i'm telling you once you know the right look for you you're going to be you're going to, you're going to know exactly what your barber is they're going to know what you come for they're going to be like oh yeah you want the same ones same as usual cool i've got my barbers now for three years now as soon as i sit in that chair he knows what i want already you the right skin fade, the right um, level of um, high top, sponge it, shakes me up and boom, I'm ready to go. So make sure that you get the right hairstyle for yourself and you should then you can use that as your avatar. That's going to be you. You don't need to change it. Once you know that this is how um, females feel like you're attracted as well, when you've got the right hairstyle, once you've got the right hairstyle, you might get more attention. Females might tell you, oh, I like this hairstyle and you're going to use that as your advantage and keep that hairstyle going. But once you get that hairstyle, you're good. Hairstyle is important, I'm telling you, it's overall it's going to make you become more confident, boost your confidence, your attractive nervous is going to go up the roof and you can overall become a better person. This is for the guys that are losing hair, mate, listen, as you get older, you start to lose hair, man, and that's the way it is, you're aging, right? But there's products, instead of using hair transplant that cost you thousands and thousands of pounds, there's a product called Monoxidil, and it's helped um, build hair follicles in your face, your hair, and also if you can have that thinning hair in the top, if you use Monoxidil, it's going to increase your hair density, improve the healthiness of it and overall your hairline is going to improve as well because the monoxidil helps fill out those gaps in your hairline instead of you going for hair transplants which costs you thousands and thousands of pounds I know a lot of people are doing that but if you ain't on that budget mate getting monoxidil costs you about 40 to 50 pounds as a hair cream is going to help fill those gaps in your hair make your hair become more full and overall your look is going to become more better as well I know a lot of guys now that I speak to, they always say, oh, I wish my hair was more full, like yours. I, I was like, listen, I'm using this certain creams that's going to help my, my hair become more healthy. Like, if I didn't use it, my hair won't be as full. So I'm using certain creams that monoxidil. deal. Yeah, as I was saying, <laughs> the noise in the background, let me finish off. So basically, getting the right hair product is going to help improve the density of your hair. Because a lot of hairstyles now, or a lot of people, as you get older, your hair starts to thin out. So getting the right hair product is going to improve yourself improve the overall hair you're gonna become more attractive and overall feeling more confident when speaking to women that's it guys five five things to help you improve yourself for a budget it'd be easy recording this video because of the noise but hope you enjoyed it click on the subscribe button like comment and subscribe andrew faq vlogs we're moving we're building and guys join the team we need more people we need more men that want to improve themselves so we can spread the word Andrew FAQ Vlogs, catch me on Instagram, Andrew FAQ underscore fitness. Till next time guys, peace.